to the spider's power. I am the spider. With me is Steven. Say hello to the nice people, Steven. And this is a weekly YouTube series I plan on starting that will look into the fragmented mind of the spider's alter ego, Chris Johnson. This first episode will be more or less an introduction of who I am and kind of just discuss what I will be doing on this show. I just got this digital camera, uh, video camera, uh, Friday, and I've been saving up for it for a long time. I have my friends and family to thank. They uh, got me a wide assortment of Best Buy gift cards and an assortment of cash that I was able to put together and finally get one. Uh, I live here in Louisville, Kentucky. I'm 29 years old. I graduated back in uh, December with my master's in library science. Uh, I do wear contacts. Uh, I'm just wearing my glasses right now. That's not really important though. Anyway. <laughs> um, I'm a huge horror movie fan and we'll take a brief tour through some of my uh, items here in the apartment. Um, also, I'm a huge uh, comic book collector. I have over 5,500 comics. Uh, I'm a huge toy collector. I've got Godzilla figures and then uh, He-Man, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, whatever. So yes, I'm a big old geek, but who cares? Geeks are in. Nerds. Whatever you want to call us. <laughs> um, I... Uh, also, I'm a, uh, for musical purposes, I'm a heavy metal, classic rock, some modern rock uh, music, but my favorite is Alice Cooper. As you could hear in the background, that was taken from this album, Alice Cooper's newest masterpiece, a concept album called Along Came a Spider. And the, for those who might be wondering why my little fake spider is called Steven, that is a name taken off of Welcome to My Nightmare, as well as Along Came a Spider. The character of Steven has been played a role in a long, long tradition of Alice Cooper songs and albums. Uh, I aspire to be a filmmaker. Um, I always figure since Hollywood is so unpredictable, you never know if you're going to make it. So that was my reasoning for getting a master's in library science. I've been with the Louisville Free Public Library now for 13 years. I started when I was 16. I've worked at different branches and now currently at the main branch in downtown Louisville. The, uh, the library degree is something I do enjoy. I do enjoy the, the profession. Uh, I figured if Hollywood falls apart, I always have the librarian degree to fall back on, which I think is very smart of me. Um, you put in a lot of uh, effort into trying to become a filmmaker and it could fall apart on you. Sadly, it's not guaranteed. I uh, look at my idols like John Carpenter and Wes Craven and they, you know, they've had their careers like this, up and down. You know, they've had successes, they've had failures, but they keep on going. But their humble beginnings is that's the, the the breaking point that's the part that you know I need to get to but first uh, I've you know got an idea of creating like my own little production company and uh, a bunch of my friends and I want to create at least one of our films anyway a zombie flick I plan on doing an assortment of little horror movies. It won't be just horror, but horror will be the stuff I probably do in the beginning because it is the easiest stuff to do. Horror is the easiest films to get made. Uh, they're the cheapest, and you can, you know, get away with a lot for so little. Uh, but beyond that, you know, expect on this show an assortment of movie reviews, opinion pieces. I plan on having a lot of my friends on here to give their feedback, I'll do various top ten lists or, you know, whatever lists that, you know, I feel like at the time. It will be guaranteed weekly, but it will not, and sometimes uh, it will be more than that, because I might go see a movie in the middle of the week and just feel the need to record that instead of waiting to the next session. 
It will be weekly, uh, so I'm not sure exactly what day it'll air. Just keep an eye on my YouTube page. Uh, and as soon as the film production company is created, we will uh, do, I will announce that on here as well. Uh, I want to give a shout out to my buddy Doug on uh, Doug Lander on YouTube and him and his friend Brian's Random Films movie account, uh, Doug86. They've put together a wide assortment of uh, short, low budget uh, little features that are just out there but they're very creative so give them a look um, hopefully uh, you'll see mine you know, soon enough but in the meantime enjoy the show and Stephen says it's time to go now so we'll see you in Stephen's Nightmares farewell